Hi, that's the first verse of the very first song I ever wrote, Good Friend Blues. I've been inspired by my sister-in-law, Leslie, who's doing a 90-day video challenge on Facebook to post some daily videos. I'm not going to go 90 days, I'm more likely to go about 30 days. And I thought each day I would give an insight into how I play certain of my songs on the guitar or perhaps banjo and just give a little insight. Intentions not to teach anybody the song, not to teach anybody how to play guitar. But if you do play guitar or a little bit interested, this should give you enough insight to see where the song's kind of coming from. It was the very first song I ever wrote. It's an open G tuning, which as opposed to a normal guitar tuning, it means that the two E strings, the first string and the sixth string, are tuned down from E to a D. And the fifth string, which would normally be an A, is tuned down to a G. So when you hit the guitar or strum it with nothing, no hands, open strings, you get an open G chord. If you play then at the fifth fret, either with a finger or with a bottleneck, it becomes a C chord. And at the seventh fret, it becomes a D chord. The song's built around these three chords. The main riff is played with a alternating thumb pattern on the fourth and fifth strings. And the higher part of the riff, the more trebly sound, comes from the third and second and third strings played open and with the bottleneck at the third fret. For the rest of the song, while I'm singing on the C and the D chord, I play just with my fingers and it's like a 12 bar shuffle. C at the fifth fret, D at the seventh fret. And uh, that's really pretty much it. I just shout over the top of it and stamp my feet. There is a, an instrumental verse or two in the, in the song. If you, if you check it out online or check it out on iTunes, you'll hear that in between some of the verses, there's a little instrumental verse. It's not really a solo, but it kind of goes. That's basically using the 12th fret G with an alternating thumb pattern and again uh, playing the 5th and 7th frets but instead of playing the shuffle I'm just playing it with a slide and in between there's a classic Delta Blues riff in G connecting the whole thing which involves the 3rd and 4th string at the 3rd fret and then the 1st string at the 5th fret the end of every verse and at the end of the instrumental there's a little turnaround. It's played on the second, third and fourth strings with almost a, a D chord shape. Sliding it down, third fret, second fret, first fret, open and then I finish off with that classic Delta Blues riff. So that's a very quick insight into how I play Good Friend Blues. I can't go and don't have time now even to go into why uh, where the song came from, but it was the very first song I ever wrote. Check it out on iTunes, check it out on YouTube, and uh, I'll come back to you tomorrow with some insights into some of the other stuff that I play. Thanks a lot for watching.